and it's around four in the afternoon i want to marinate these pork i uh, not pork goat ribs i want to marinate them and then uh, my husband is the one who's gonna prepare dinner today so i want to marinate them and then go to the salon i'm taking my baby she needs to get her hair done and yeah let's get into that Just took both your hands off the wheel You act like there's nothing wrong How many tears will I cry till you know It feels like you don't even try Is this everything you had fantasized? We were in love just like fire If you are new here feel most welcome i hope by the end of the video you'll be convinced and uh, you'll have a reason to subscribe and kindly guys don't skip the ads they really really help my channel that is where i'll get my revenue kindly watch the ads and support a girl After marinating the ribs, I just went ahead and covered them and put them in, a, in the fridge for a while uh, before preparing.
thank you so much for subscribing to my channel and even to my returning subscribers thank you so much for always coming back to to watch my content i don't take it for granted the end of a long week and i thought you seemed withdrawn mm. well the truth always comes out now yours has through someone else's mouth and right now i can't move on you're telling yourself it's to protect me so you hit for the second round i decided to make them a circle and i used this container to just uh, shape shape the dough into a circle you said you're sorry because you lied to me about me now i sit at home figuring things out on my own because you took this way too far uh, you divert the blame with your self-righteous selfless claim but right now i don't know who you are who you are you're telling yourself it's to protect me so you hit away a crucial part of me of me and i can't let this go even though you've said you're sorry sorry you lied to me So guys, we took our breakfast and the mahamris were really, really good. Like I'm so proud of myself. I've never made mahamris that are that soft and delicious. So right now uh, I changed my clothes, uh, the dress that I had on because I couldn't do much with it. And I'm cleaning my living room, but I'm not shooting uh, while cleaning the living room because, yeah, because of so many reasons. So right now I've just removed my carpet, it's outside, I want to clean the floors and then I'll let her go in the kitchen, I want to clean my oven and that I'm going to do with you. So yeah, this is how my living room is looking like. Uh, my carpet is outside, I don't know if I should turn the camera or... Yeah, my carpet is outside, it's on the balcony as you can see. And my living room is looking like that, everything is just uh, not in order. I was just sweeping the dust that was under the couch so i want to mop right now then we can go and clean the oven together So the man of the house decided this was his work and he's the one who's supposed to be doing this
because they are very fragile and they can break easily. So that's why I was taking my time just to clean it pole pole. So I got this rack uh, for putting my potatoes, onions, and any other thing uh, in the kitchen because uh, the one that was under the sink, I felt like it was uh, making my things go bad because uh, I didn't want to put it outside. It, was, it doesn't have a nice color like this one, so that's why I got this one.
my kitchen is quite small and this uh, rack fit well. It fitted so well. I didn't want it to uh, occupy a lot of space in the kitchen. So uh, I liked how it occupied less space. Yeah. I had run out of groceries. I had only two onions and few few potatoes and some uh, unripe bananas, but I restocked. As you as you watch the video, you'll see I restocked. The things that I got, I got uh, these carrots. These ones were going for 100 shillings. And then I got tomatoes. And this capsicum, this one was going for 50 each. So I got two of them. We are not, like, we are not used to getting this capsicum. To me, they are green. So I wanted to try something new. I got them. Then I got uh, these spring onions for 50 shillings. Dania for 50 shillings. Then this gorget one was going for 15 bob and I was like, what? We used to buy them for 10 shillings. So I got two of them. If they were 10 bob each, I would have gotten like for 50 bob. But since they were 15 bob, these two were already 30 bob. So I got the two of them. Then I got this uh, Kawaida Capsicum. This one were going for 10 bob each. I got broccoli, 50 bob. Uh, it, okay, I got one because... Nowadays, we are not eating broccoli that much in the house, so I wanted to just get something that we will eat and finish. It's here in the fridge. Then I got cauliflower. It was going for 50 bob as well. Then I got uh, I got these green domas. These ones are going for 100. I'll just clean them and remove these things before uh, storing them. Then I got minji. Uh, green peas, it's so expensive out here. But uh, this guy was selling uh, this. This is just one glass, one glass of of green peas, and this one was going for eighty bob. But he sold it at uh, at fifty bob to me, so I got just one. This is mekwa gold. Then I got um, then I got these potatoes. They were going for three hundred shillings, and I prefer buying big big potatoes because uh, like this one, I can just peel one of it and make it and just cook stew with it instead of the small ones then i got um onions garlic and and ginger and then i got that cabbage yeah the cabbage was going for 50 bob and it's quite big so i got one of of it and then i got these bananas yeah that's all I got.
So as I was cleaning the arrow roots, I've started scratching myself. I don't know why. Ish. Started feeling so itchy on my hands. What? I've not even finished cleaning them. I've decided that say I've decided I'll peel them and then I'll put them in the fridge and boil them tomorrow because they were so dirty. I feel like this woman sold to me, sold to me like Apparently, in chairs. Apparently, in chairs. Because the these domas were dirty, man. I wish I just got them at another place. But it's okay. We lose some. We win some. Yeah. So, guys, I had finished uh, cleaning those ones. Uh, the cabbage, I'll just split it and then I'll wrap it and put it in the fridge. And the same as broccoli and cauliflower. Some danias in there with some a uh, little water. It's in Billy, I'll put them in the fridge. I don't even want to catch water. Actually, I'm scratching myself so much. It is so bad. So, those things, those nomas, are the ones that are making me scratch. I don't, I don't even want to touch water, side. So, I'll just go chill. Nijikule mbaka nitsuke ni metosheka and then I'll come back and finish uh, wrapping these things by that time those ones will have already dried so it will be easy for me to pack them in the fridge